Almost every major city in the United States has a problem with topless clubs, like New York or Chicago or Los Angeles. I think the craze really started here in Los Angeles. What usually happens is the city fathers will go down to one of these clubs for like uh, six or eight weeks, and they'll try to decide whether they're violating an ordinance or not. <laughs> and in Los Angeles, we not only have dinner topless clubs, they now have lunch in topless clubs and are going to start breakfast topless clubs. These are two guys who walk into a topless club, only they don't know that it's a topless club. Gee, this, this is a real nice place, Harry, you know? Yeah, sure. They must have great food here. They, they do a heck of a luncheon business. They sure there. do, yeah. <laughs> Oh, hi, miss. Yes, I like a, uh... Oh! <laughs> the tablecloth, Harry. Don't stare at it, will you, please? Now, I like a, uh... <laughs> I like a scotch on the rocks. Uh, water. Wa water. Uh, se seven up. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Make that two seven ups in water. <laughs> <laughs> Do you believe that, Harry? Did you see that? Boy, she must have been late for work. That's ridiculous. Yeah, we better get out of here. This, there's going to be a raid in this place, and there's no question about it. I'll tell you that. We better call the wives. Tell them we're here. Oh, all right. You, you got any change on you? <laughs> oh, hi, hi, Mr. Uh, you, uh, you, you have a pair of nickels. Uh, two, two nickels for a dime. 